y'all this is Rochelle and welcome back to my channel Rochelle's plans thank you for joining me for another plan with me and in today's plan with me we are planning for the week of May the 10th through the 16th so if you want to see how this video turns out keep watching all right y'all so we have the pages out of the planner now let me show y'all what sticker books I plan on using for this spread I have the spring florals sticker book by Jessica over at live love posh and I will be using these stickers here. I think they are so beautiful. I've used them once before and I just love them. I think this Happy Plan sticker book will pair well with the flowers. So I have that here. I have this black and white sticker book um, that I'm going to get some quotes out of that sticker book. And then I have this Happy Planner and Joanne, uh, the first mega sticker book um, that I'm going to get some quotes out of here as well. And then I may have to come in with this OG colorful boxes for um, some pink stickers if I cannot find them here in the Happy Plans sticker book. And I have my wax paper here. So if you all are new to my channel, let me just say, Welcome and thank you for stopping by to watch this plan with me. If you are a return subscriber, welcome back. Um, I hope that you all enjoy what you see. And if you do, um, I would truly appreciate if you would subscribe to my channel. I do post videos or playing with me regularly um, at least three to four times a week I also do budgeting videos and um, yeah so at least three to four times a week sometimes on a good week you would get five to six I'm trying to post more regularly each week for you guys and um, so, yeah, if you do enjoy what you see, I would appreciate it if you would um, subscribe to my channel. It does help me out a lot um, with the, um, the comments and the views. So, and I am trying to um, increase my subscriber count and my views. So that is that but y'all i hope you all are doing well staying safe and enjoying your weekend today is saturday evening um it's about 5 40 that i'm planning this doing this plan with me and um uh, y'all let me just say this i'm taking out a lot of stickers here let me just say i might not use all these stickers either y'all that my husband took me out for dinner today at my favorite restaurant which is called Papado's Papado's Seafood Kitchen if you guys um, don't know about that restaurant oh my gosh y'all it is great now a lot of people from Louisiana would say that's not real seafood well, you know what? It is to me because I grew up in Arkansas and the only seafood that we had was catfish. Well, only seafood I ate was catfish. So it's real seafood to me. Y'all took off just about all those stickers. I might even use all of them. If I don't, I am going to put them back in the... <coughs> Excuse me. If I don't, they will be going back in um, this sticker book. But y'all, let me just say this. Let me pull this off. When we were out there waiting, because you could not, they wouldn't let you uh, do reserve, wouldn't, wouldn't let you reserve a table, I guess because of the Mother's Day weekend and then the rush that they were expecting to have. So while we were out outside waiting at the restaurant this place is like outside it's covered in 
flowers and greenery and stuff. Now, I am allergic to all grasses and weeds. So, this is why I am sounding like this, all nasally and stopped up and sniffling. I'm going to try to edit out as much sniffling as I possibly can. However, if I can't, just know that those flowers and things like that triggered my allergies really bad. Y'all, I could not, I went on this sneezing fit. I could not stop sneezing. Y'all, I look like Rudolph over here. My nose is so red. It is really something serious. My, um, you know, I kept sneezing. I could not stop sneezing. And finally, I told my husband, because we were sitting on a bench outside, and our wait was, um, she, the girl told me, the hostess told me that it would be like an hour and five minutes. I think we waited about 50 minutes, which was good. I'm not complaining. And so I finally told my husband, I said, I got to move. I cannot. I don't know where I was going, y'all. You know how you just get up and you just start walking? Maybe not you, but that's what I did. I mean, I just got up and started walking. It's because it was, I'm like, I just, I can't do this. It is like, it's driving me crazy. So I know I want a sticker. Do I want it here? Or do I want to use one of these stickers over in the corner. I don't know. Let's see. But yeah, I just got up and started walking. And I know he was like, where are you going? But I just, I had to move away as, you know, in my head, I had to move away from those dang flowers. But y'all, I was telling y'all before I switched subjects, I am allergic to all grasses and weeds. All of them. Um, how do I know? Is because I did the allergy testing when we were living in Arkansas and I used to administer um, allergy medicine to myself every week and I used to inject it into my thigh I had to go to the pharmacy and I would have to buy syringes and um, I would go to my ear nose and throat um, location and then they would give me the vials of the medicine right yeah it was a whole thing and when they tested me they I don't know if you guys have ever been tested for allergies I wouldn't advise this to anybody but um, they you know they prick you with the things you may be allergic to and they did mine on my upper left side um, arm and I mean it was about 30 different things I could possibly be allergic to right and so if um, the area where they input whatever allergen if that area if it grows to I don't know what the centimeter is um, you have to go back, I think the next day and they look at it and they'll circle it. Um, because if it grows or if it gets bigger than the certain centimeter, then they know you're allergic to it. Y'all, my entire arm. No, it wasn't my right arm. It, I mean, I was allergic to everything. So they were like, okay, well, yep, you're allergic to all grasses and weeds. I was like, <laughs> like, yeah, I pretty much knew that. But yeah, so that's where we are okay so i could put this here and or i could put one here i think i may want to do that let's do this one so yeah y'all it was in my i said my left arm my left upper arm it was my right upper arm and when i tell you that my arm it was let me put this right here just like so when i tell y'all that my arm itched and it was a mess y'all i had that done in june and i remember because we were going to 
my cousin's wedding in Atlanta and the entire ride there from Arkansas was miserable. Raylan, my oldest daughter, she was one or yeah, she was one. She was about to turn two because then and I wasn't married yet. So this was in 2000. Three, I want to say. Yeah, 2003, because we got married. This was in June. We got married in July, so the next month. And that's how I remember. But, y'all, it was sheer torture. I mean, I want, I don't even know if I cried. If I didn't cry, I wanted to cry because the pain. I mean, I, it wasn't painful. The itch was so intense. I don't know if you guys have ever just been, um, had an itch. And I couldn't like really just scratch it. Y'all, it was terrible. It was terrible. Um, Dion's nephew had the same test performed here in Dallas um, on his back. And he's allergic. And he is severely allergic to a lot of things too. And there is no way I would have done that on my back, y'all. Because I wouldn't have been able to get to this itch. So, yeah, it's crazy. But anyway, I survived. And that's why I sound like this, because we were out there, outside, by all of those flowers. And I am paying for it. And y'all, my throat, you know how you, I sneezed so much that my throat started burning um, it was just bad. I couldn't stop sneezing. I had a sneezing fit. So I'm going to put this all the way down. I kind of didn't want to go all the way down. I want this to go all the way down. But this is going to be a long to-do list for this week. And I like to put these in my sidebar to give me, um, you know, to have a running to-do list. I like to put these here. So let's do this. And hopefully it's straight. But you guys know how I am. It's probably not. That doesn't look too bad, I don't think. So y'all, we do not have a lot going on this week. I have some bills that are due. Um, don't have much going on Monday. Or Tuesday well since cheer our cheer season is over with basically we don't have practices on Mondays and Wednesdays anymore we still have tumbling on Tuesdays and Thursdays she still has her private lessons on Wednesdays and y'all and then tumbling on Tuesdays Thursdays and Sunday Sundays so then like I said Dion well, Dion normally gets paid on the 15th, but since the 15th is on a Saturday, he'll get paid on the 14th. So will I, and then I'll pay bills on the 14th. Yeah, so we don't have a lot going on. Oh, and then Ryan has her high school cheer banquet on the 13th. So we don't have too much going on, per se. Oh, when she does, she has um, competitive cheer tryouts for the next season on Sunday. So y'all, we really we really don't get a break from cheer, competitive cheer, high school cheer. That is something totally different. But for competitive cheer, I'm looking for a decorative box. Is what I'm looking for. We really don't get a break from competitive cheer because once the cheer season is over with, um, I mean you're getting ready, and it's typically over in May because you go to um, the summit, which is in Orlando, Florida. So, I kind of like this one, but I'll gonna, I'm going to cover this up though, but I really just want a, a fully decorative box sticker. Let's just see. I'm going to come in with some black. Let's just look in this black and white sticker book. So yeah, we typically don't get any time off because once you're done you are you go right into the next season 
with um because you're doing tryouts okay i like this one let's do this one if i use this do i have to use um this type of washi that's what i'm wondering i don't want it to be too overpowering that's what i don't want with the pattern is what i'm trying to say so i could technically use where are those stitches my box stickers they're right here i could use one of these i'm going to do this let's just do this so yeah whoa uh -oh. we don't get a lot of downtime in cheer so do i want it like this or like this i can't see it i think i may do it like this Let's just put this in the box. So yeah, so we don't get a lot of downtime in cheer. Once we're done with one, do I want this here? I could do it like this. When we're done with, let's just do it like this. I'm gonna not put it so I'm not gonna put it uh, centered in the box. We're gonna do it like this. I hope this looks okay. And I hope this is straight. I hope that looks okay. Okay, so we have that there. Um, Should I put a flower behind it? I think I should. Which one? Do we want that one? Let's come in with some boxes. Have that one there. Let's get some boxes. Yeah, so, y'all, this is the third time I'm saying this. We don't get much of or much downtime in cheer, competitive cheer, because once you're done with one, I want this one. When you're done with the season, you go right into the next season. So that's how that goes. I'm gonna put this here like so. Let's put it on the wax paper first. And this one as well. I think I may need a bigger one though. We can put this one like this. Sorry about my sniffling, y'all. We can do this like this. Just scoot it over to the right some. And do I want pink or do I want um, the blue? And then do I want this size? We can do this one. It's not exactly the same color and that's okay I think that's okay we'll do that like so and then so we have that there got a bill due on the 12th what do we have I mean not a bill due on the 10th I said the 12th so I don't when I put down boxes y'all I don't necessarily know what they're gonna be for when I um, put them down, when I put down boxes, I don't know, I don't always know what they're going to be for, but trust and believe that they will be used for something. Yeah, I just don't always know that right off the bat. And a lot of times it's for decorative purposes anyway. I like this one here. This is just, uh oh, I almost tore that. Is that the same size? Let's do this on the wax paper. I'm 
let's just do it like this. I know I covered up May. I think it'll be okay. Let's cut the excess off. I think that's cute. Now I could come in. Let's just use my scraps and let's put this over here. I don't like to waste any of my stickers, y'all. We'll put that there like so. Okay, so we have that there. Now on the 12th, I have a bill this Hulu is due on the 12th but that comes out automatically I mean I still could put something there like today or something like that I could do that what color let's see what else we have so y'all let me know what do you guys oh let me say this I meant to say this a long time ago Happy Mother's Day to all of you mothers out there watching my video. Happy Mother's Day. I hope you all have a wonderful Mother's Day um, and are able to enjoy it with the ones that you love. Um, we're not doing a whole lot. My husband... We went out and did some things today. Well, we went out today and he treated me to, I said this earlier, he treated me to lunch at my favorite restaurant. And, um, yeah, I had, he had me a, um, massage scheduled for tomorrow but they called him and told him that the girl didn't show up no it was scheduled for today it was scheduled for today but they called him and said the girl didn't show up today or something happened and that he would have to reschedule it no they had somebody else it was a man and he did not want um a guy to give me the massage and i don't blame him but so he rescheduled it do i have a pink one he rescheduled it and y'all the only thing that i had available was um may 25th and it's not at the one that he ske originally scheduled it at it's in a different city which is not far from here it's about 15 minutes away. The one he had it scheduled was, is about, um, I, I guess about 30 minutes away. I kind of want, do I want pink? So I'm trying to do stay with, um, pink, yellow, and this blue here. I kind of want to put another box sticker here too, just so that I can have like this you know, layering effect. So let me find another box sticker. Maybe I could do maybe this one, maybe this small pink one. I guess I could do this. Yeah, let's just do this. I think that's cute. This is for my Hulu bill. Thursday, Ryan has a banquet. So I need to, let's do that. Let's find a box sticker for that. And let's put this over here. We could do this one. I'm gonna come back in with some deco also. We gotta get this playing with me on the road, y'all. I've been talking, running my mouth, and not 
finishing up this plant with me. Hopefully it's not too long and hopefully y'all stay and watch the entire video. So, um, I don't know what I was saying, y'all. I really don't know. Is that straight? It looks, in, it looks like it's in the same spot. Oh, well, it is what it is. It is what it is. And why did I put that there? That should have gone down here because the banquet is at like 6.30. So, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna take that up and put this sticker here. Where are my tweezers? Take this up. And y'all, hold on a second. We're gonna take this one. going to put this one down here in this box and I'm going to do some layering if I can put this in this box straight take this off okay let's take that off of there I do kind of want, I want another box sticker off of that. Let's see, we could do, is there a yellow one? Yeah, we've got a yellow sticker that we could use. I don't have any more of those bigger ones like this. Doesn't look like it. I don't think so. Let's just look to see, got that one. It has gold on it, doesn't it? We don't have any more of those. I have this one, but I don't have any other ones with the black on it. So we'll just use this one, this smaller one. And we'll just do this like this. Just like that. Friday is payday. I kind of need a box sticker up here. We'll just do one here. Let's just do this one. Let's do this one here. And now this way, this time I'll turn the box upside down so that the speckles are at the bottom of the page of the box and not at the top, just like that. I'm gonna come in with a flower I do want what color flower do I want I like this okay y'all so this is going to be tricky I'm going to take my craft knife here I'm going to trim around this sticker And hopefully it's straight. Hopefully. Oh, not that piece. Let's get this piece. I may have to use my undo. Get some undo here. Don't freak out, y'all. This is just undo. And I get this off of Amazon. It's in the description box below. All you do is wet your page like I just did. And you just take the sticker up just like so. It doesn't harm the sticker or your planner paper or anything. It just allows you to lift up your sticker easily. Okay. So we have that there. 
And what else y'all do we need? Uh, it looks, it's looking pretty empty. My puppy, y'all. I don't know, he hears somebody outside or something. Let's come in with some bullet points. He barks, y'all, whenever he hears anybody. Um, he thinks, I don't know. You know how puppies are. Or dogs in general. They hear something, they bark. Let's do pink. I don't know. Somebody may be up there. I'm not sure. Oh, that's my mother-in-law. And I don't know why he's barking at her. He was just staying with her um, the other week while we were... Um, both were out of town because she puppy sat for us. Let's see. Do you want to put this on Saturday? We can. Just put it here. Put those two on Saturday. Okay, y'all. Now, I need some more deco. I like these, like important stickers. Like those, I like these too. Like just be yourself. We need one of these. I think I might put it like, well, I've got um, yellow and yellow. I guess I could put it right here. I could do it. I don't want to do that yellow and yellow. I'll just put it right here. Just be yourself. Just like that. So we have that one there. I want like a blue one. I may have to use this just go for it over here. Maybe. Maybe. Let's use this yellow one. I'm going to use this yellow one and put it up here. I think I may, let's lift up these stickers here. Will that be too much? I feel like I need another sticker down here. Or do I need to put this one? Let's see, how could I do it? If I did, no, that's too much. Maybe if I put this one here, let's see. If I did this one here, then I have yellow. Uh-oh, I have yellow right there too. Can't put it right there. We'll just go ahead and do it right here. But let's lift up this sticker. Let's lift this corner. And then we'll do this one. Uh oh. Okay. So we have that there. Is that a piece of hair? I think that may be the other page, the other side. Okay. Need something here. That box just looks plain by itself over there. Do I have another pink? I have important. I could put down. Put this right here. Like that. I think that's cute. And I feel like I need something else. Um, it just looks so plain to me. I 
let's see here. I had this out. You know what? I need a quote. Let's see. This black and white sticker book, y'all, is so good for it has the best quotes in here. I love them. Which one do I want though? Let's see. Found this one here. It says, No one has ever become poor from giving. So true. It's better to give than it is to receive. Do I want this here? Or over here? I want a cluster. I could do it over here. I have to let me let me get my jelly roll out. And let's wipe this out. Oh my gosh, did y'all see that? Wow. We're going to fix it. Okay. Where is my tape? Okay. Where did it go? Right there. We're going to fix this. Okay. So, because we're not wasting it, that's for sure. Okay. Easy fix. Put this here. Okay. There we go. Now, you can put this here. And it is not straight, but there it is it's not straight but there it is now i kind of feel like i want some flowers over here because i have them in like this corner this corner that corner and this corner. i don't have anything over here so let's put something over here and we can do these two yeah let's well should we do this one? Let's just see. I got to be careful so that I don't rip this one. Do that there. And then we'll do, should I put, let's put, let's put this on top of this one here. do it like that and then let's cut off this excess and then we'll cut off this okay I think that's cute so now I have flowers in every corner I have my washi tape here, y'all. Y'all know that this is one of my favorite washi tapes. And then I also got this too. I just got this one. Um, I think this would be really cute too. I always use this one. This is a bigger, um, the grid lines are they're spaced out further than these. This one is a different pattern. So let's see. I don't know, but I got it from Amazon, off of Amazon. I will link it in the description box though, y'all, if you wanna check it out.
it's so thick I'm gonna tear it and then just come in like I normally do and then just rip it and then we're going to come in on this side and do the same thing well you know what first I'm going to do it up here. It says uh, new day, same goal. I'm going to put it right here. Right there. I kind of want a flower here. So let's, let's get a flower. Which one do we want? We have this one here. I don't have this green color. Let's do this. Why is this ripping? I don't understand why it's ripping. Okay, so I put that flower there. And now let's come in with some more washi. I kind of want another, I have one over here. I kind of want a smaller quote over here also. Put this little piece right here. And I'll just cut that so that it can be flush up against the side of the box. Okay, I'm thinking I want to do the same. Oh my goodness, y'all, with this one. Yeah, let's just cut it. y'all um so i came in with the washi tape i put all the washi down um, got the bullet points i got my two quotes here these uh, remember remember and importance i got out of this uh, first collapse sticker book mega sticker book and um, i added these other two bullet points all right y'all so with that um I am calling this spread done. I was trying to figure out where I could put this sticker because I have this one over here and I don't have another one on this side of the page. I am just not going to worry about it and I'm calling this spread done. So I'm spending too much time on it. So let's put these pages back in the planner and see how it looks. All right, y'all, so here's my completed spread. I love how this turned out. I hope you all enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to follow me over on Instagram at Playing With Rochelle. And thanks so much for watching. Bye, guys.